down alone and thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. You heard about the heist, I take it. Must have, uh, talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Whole damn city's hurt. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I won't? When we meet, let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? seen you here 
here before. Got a good memory for faces. Bar's closed. Sorry, Chief. To talk. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Scare away any customers and you're out. Feast your eyes on this. <laughs> Every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed. You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that clear. What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high, or sink into quicksand. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Listen, have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why, so you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. it wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Something to say? Say it. Heated exchange there with Judy. What was that all about? How's this any of your business? Gonna follow up with your own sermon on responsibility for others? Go on, your high horse is waiting. I'm just curious. One thing I know about curiosity won't get you shit unless you got the fists and the ass to back it up. You know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. You might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. And anyone not a mox is not my damn problem. I'm guessing the club brings in a lot of biz. 
piss is it share a cost, too? Why, looking to invest? Nah, I'm just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. Where do you give the working girls a helping hand? That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot. Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first, just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Streets overflowed with raised fists. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. <coughs> Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight.
on. I said goodbye. I see the only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What if I miss this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Our sock and the tiger claws are in bed together. Every oh, corpse plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang, suits collars, and gets sore. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. Someone's in a great mood. Not every day a half-brain dead dude drags me around a cat house on a wild whore chase. So having a grand old time. The NCPD has raised the Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Jack in, please. Looking for Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting? Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire? We find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled. And maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. All right, let's do this. 
This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky I'd rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Cloud is dig, one of the Johnny. safest places in all of Night City. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay then. V. Welp, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V. You're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside. You fear this power before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. There's something in those mirrors. Way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. 
You're afraid of something else. You just gonna talk in circles? That it? I can't help you if you don't want to be helped. What's next? Meditation? Something like that. Try me. Just answer my question. Tell me where Evelyn is. Don't have time for a debate. Why the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was Evelyn last here? You know anything. Evelyn had her own story before it collided with yours. But I know you'll find her. You always get your way. Think you know me well? Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. Had a true friend once. Now he's gone. Soon I'll be gone, too. Except... Won't have anyone by my side. Everything you need, you already carry inside you. You're scared, because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change. That thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else. Forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel... a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear? Is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? Now... You find out what it is. You need to do. Which is. You're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you... Never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh... For all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on?
going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? I gotta say, that wasn't what I expected. I was hoping for thrills, not some gloomy, soul-searching debate. Look, baby, I don't decide what happens in here. Your subconscious drives everything. Hmm. Next time, remind me to tell my subconscious to go fuck itself. Um, just don't tell anyone about this, okay? I came here to talk to you, Sky, not some soppy algorithm. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody'd care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. The customer attacked her? I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Gonna just stand there or tell me a number. Eleven. This booth occupied now? Nah. I think it's been out of order since... Um... Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah? And do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll. Like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth 2. I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Bad, but it would be much better, real. I would eat those thighs. What do you mean, real? I can't get in. What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking You're week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh yes, I am. No. Hey. Uh, uh, uh,
You're not in trouble. Just want to talk for a little. Heard you and Evelyn get along famously. Is that true? Yeah. We go way back. Always stuck together. Why do you ask? Where's Evelyn? Need to talk to her urgently. It's important. Well, are you mad at her or something? No. Know where she is or not. Uh, she's not here. Tried calling her more than once, no answer. Heard she was chipping a new faceplate in a clinic in Osaka. No, no, Oslo. That was it. Osaka or Oslo? Which is it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, yeah, definitely Oslo. Evelyn tell you personally she was going away? Um, no, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. <laughs> Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but we all call him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. Who is he? Um, he's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Okay, Cap. Interesting word choice for someone who plowed through massacring all along the way. Let's Things got out of this. hand, I'll admit. But cooperate, and no one else will get hurt. I don't negotiate with terrorists. You're the king of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless Bye. eyes? Or scour his comp? That just might work. Ship was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. You 
you come out alone. Let's take a look, shall we? Blood. Fresh. Not too much. 
Put it to a wound rather than a kill. See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. There should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. They rip it out? Wonder why. Well, Klein wasn't the one who flew off the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. A netrunner? Weird. Nice work back there. Oh, Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? And, and that's Don't have time to massage egos. No. I respect that. <laughs> of course you do. You'd have loved to have dropped the H-bomb in this place. No need to go so OTC. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. No feeling going on, no thinking, no awareness. I think Fingers got her. I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Tried, it fell flat. Now you're flat. 
Don't look in any condition to find Helmet. Advising travelers to avoid... We'll continue to keep you informed as the situation develops. Ah, oh, fuck! What <laughs> the hell's that? No, 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 damn it. Damn it. What do you want from me? It's all going too slow. I'm gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settlement, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel Listen, kind of honored, I actually. know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so. This Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. see how Mikoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are ya? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Mikoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <sighs> Bet it still is today. Telling ya, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. So, you ready? And, uh, how you plan to smash Arisaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bomb's named Alta Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside Makoshi. 